Silver Island, this is Henry. Um, that asked me back from the, uh, the after convention now, so it's been a long road. Um, it's been a really good weekend. Uh, obviously, I was at the MCM uh, Expo Comic Con Scotland, which is great. Twenty sixteen. Um, like it's, it's been it's been a really good uh, event. I would say this year because what happened was um, I bought a few good things. So be, this today I would be doing my my haul video with the stuff I bought. Which is great. Uh, I bought quite a good few good things. Um, it wasn't as very many compared to last year, but uh, I'm still going to show you anyway what I've got because some of them are quite decent. Um, but I just want to give a shout out to the folks that who I bumped into, who I met, which is like I bumped into. Well, obviously one of my good friends. I mean, the mental haggis David. Um, he was with me all, all you know all the way through to the convention with me because he was uh, he was sharing room with hotel with me with my roommate. So basically. We both stayed in the hotel, uh, which is really great, and we we just been doing sort of cosplays together and stuff, and uh, on the road we're doing like uh, pictures and videos and stuff, which is great. Um, but yeah, you should go go check his channel by the way. I really uh, appreciate all your fans because he is a really great guy. Trust me. Uh, I want to give a shout out to all the other folks that who people I met as well, which is uh, with Jack, yeah, Super Jack DC. Uh, radio, <laughs> radio fans, parents, and uh, Rebecca, uh, Katie, uh, and Sarah as well. Uh, Kamikaze Katie, which you know I've not seen her for a while, but I managed to see her. Um, I saw uh, my friend Craig Garden as well, and I saw uh, Kerry as well. I think uh, Shadow Lugia cosplay. I think <laughs> um, there's so many folks I've seen as well. I've seen David Bell, uh, Ronan Knight. And I've seen uh, Tarnit and Kawaii, uh, which is which is she's great. Um, it's just so many folks I can I, I can just remember the names. Hopefully, <laughs> you you know that uh, like you know uh, people who are watching this. So um, I just want to give you a shout outs because it's just so many of you guys. I really appreciate it all um, for supporting my channel, and I support yours as well, definitely. <laughs> um, but. It's a shame that, that some folks that didn't make it to MCM Comic Con, which I was going to hope and see them. Um, hopefully, you guys will come back next year. Hopefully, because I'm coming back next year. Um, hopefully, all the best. Um, also, that uh, for the photos and videos and all, I'm still get, I'm still working on it in a moment. It's just it's so hectic because um, I have to do a couple things back at home when I when I came back. Um, but it's just crazy. I still I love the convention. I, I actually enjoyed Saturday mostly, but I wish I could explain all this. But you will see, you will see it. You will see it yourself once I upload other videos, because like the journey of it is just fantastic. Um, it's, it's a bit different compared to last year. I would say it's really really different. Um, but I'm quite happy with what uh, what I've seen so far. So, um, I would say, I would say like um. The convention wise i would say nine out of ten i would say eight, between eight or nine but mostly nine, nine out of ten because of it um but i wish i i wish i could explain more but <laughs> anyways i'm gonna show you my haul stuff now because there's some stuff are really really great and it's crazy actually i really like the stuff i've got so first off i'm gonna show you is the Scotland Loves Anime book. I think uh, there was a there were some people were giving away from these ones, just handing flyers and stuff. So I got that. So I had to pick this up because I I decided to have a wee read and see what see what they have in this book. Uh, see what few pages what they've got. Um. Also, like I know I'll be going to watch Kingslave because the uh, anime. Well, Scotland Loves Anime are advertising that for film for Kingslave or Final Fantasy. Which I'll be watching, so I'll definitely look, go into that because I'm into Final Fantasy, which is great. So I've not seen it yet, but I can't wait to watch it though. I really do. So that's that. Um, also that. Also, I got the these flyers, well, the business cards I got, I gave out. So well, I had to back, I'll pick up and stuff. Some of the business ones are really great. I've got two. I got something. I got two of these. These ones are like well designed. I don't know if you can see it properly. If not, then I, it's just because they're so tiny and they're so different. Uh, I got another business car, which I think uh, Le Levi, which is a Lily that is. <laughs> and then we've got that as well, so I'll explain that one later. Another photographer, photographer, 
another photographer. <laughs> There's just so many photographer ones. I got a cosplayer as well, so but I'm keeping that. That's pretty cool. Um, what else? I've got another uh, photographers as well, which is it's mental. It's it's crazy. I I actually really like I really thank them for handing out the business cards and all that. And I'm still going to make mine. I'm going to try and make mine at some point as well. And uh, once I'm working away saving money, so I will. I mean, I'm making a brand new one, so I'm still working on it. Um, so that's that. And also, um, I kept this as well. So I kept the the wristband of this, I would say, because I'm keeping this because it's like a reminder of the uh, the MCM I went to from this year. Um, I didn't want to, I don't want to bin this because I use that as like a souvenir, I would say. So it's which is pretty cool. I wonder if any any of you guys who ever went, I wonder if you guys still. Uh, still got it or binned it or keep it. I mean, so that's if you if you kept it, then that's pretty cool. If you binned it, I'll be oh unlucky. Um, but yeah, I'm definitely keeping this anyway. So that's uh, let's see how you remind her. So which is great. Um, also I'll be giving it like free sweeties and all that stuff. <laughs> like these one like pizza sweets, a wee chocolate, and then I've got that as well. So <laughs> so that's that one. Um, well, I was gonna show. You. I'll show you the this one, right? I got. I found this, right? I found uh, one of the dealers were selling uh, the some figurines and stuff randomly, and I found uh, out of nowhere, right? I found the uh, Final Fantasy figure uh, model, so which is great. It's a uh, uh, Final Fantasy Trading Arts uh, Volume Two, which is uh, Vincent. It uh, cost about fifteen quid, which is is on the tag there. I don't know if you can see it. But I was like, 15 quid? No way. I was like, I thought it was going to be worth more than that. Because you know how some Square Enix toys could be a bit expensive nowadays. But um, but this one, 15 quid? Oh, well, I had to pick it up, mate, as well. Because it's even it's this size of the box. But since I, uh, it's the last one, so I may as well, I'm lucky to get pick it up. Um, but this this is going to go in my collection. So I'm not going to be opening this box. But I am definitely going to put it as my collection. Because this, this is too good, man. So... Um, it may come in handy, so I'm going to keep that anyway, so <laughs> so that's that. Uh, the next one I got is um, one of the dealers was like, basically what happened was, right, one of the dealers was really, has all the, all the creative, cre uh, creativity of the, the stuff, like mugs and uh, birthday cards and all that stuff, which is great, but the, the one I caught my eye on was this. I so saw this is a uh, Digimon. Uh, this is like look at this uh, the, uh, this designs of the this kind of art stuff like uh, designs. It's pretty cool. Um, I had to buy this because I know there's other ones like um, Kingdom Hearts, Pokemon, Digimon, and uh, Adventure Time and all that stuff. Um, I had to get Digimon because obviously it looks it do look stand out. But I wish I bought Kingdom Hearts though. You know what I mean? But I, it's worth fifteen quid each. But I don't want to buy too many mugs and stuff, you know what I mean? Because I don't want to waste it, you know what I mean, at my house. But I like collecting mugs and stuff and cups, but I don't want to overfill too much, you know what I mean? Because sometimes in my room I have no uh, no space to put in. But uh, this this will this will be enough anyway, so hopefully I'll find enough space. But uh, So that's, that's definitely a mug. Bio. I'll try and open it. I'll show you what it looks like anyway, so if I can... It's all wrapped up anyway, so... As Oh, it is wrapped up, yeah, it is. Huh. I like how they kept it really nice. So that's what it looks like. It's pretty nice, though, the, the mug. <laughs> I'm going to save this, man. I'm not going to be using it because, obviously, it's like a wee masterpiece trophy. So so I'm going to keep I'm gonna keep that um, safely and stuff, so it's going to be coming handy. I'll put this back, actually, because I don't want to damage it, so... So that's that. So that so that was that, right? Uh, if you wonder where I got, I got this, that's the page of it. So it's it's called Blue Potion. So that is definitely from that one. So it's called definitely called Blue Potion. Check it on um, their uh, their shop store or check it on their Facebook page as well. So um, it's called Blue Potion UK. So just check on it as well. So I I I, I recommend to get it. So. So that's pretty good. Cool. It's it's really good. I like the designs they made. It's worth uh, fifteen quid each, I think, because that's what I bought it from. So I'm gonna try and buy more, I'm thinking. So, so that's that. Um, the next one I bought is the Lego main of it. So that's all Marvel's characters. Um, I'm into Lego Marvel stuff. So, so I decided to buy the different characters, the ones I've not got. 
Um, so those are the ones I've not got so far. Obviously there's a female uh, Spider Woman. Uh, we've got uh, Stan Lee, Emma Frost, uh, I think that's Human Torch. I think that's Human Torch. Uh, Black Panther, Doctor Doom, Colossal, uh, Colossal. Uh, I think or Colossus, I can't remember how it's in there. Get mixed up with it because I've not played uh, a level of Marvel in ages. Uh, Doctor Doom as well, so I think it is. I'm not sure. I can't get mixed up with these two because I'm not playing the Lego Marvel. I need to get used to it because I, I know like simple easy ones nowadays. <laughs> I mean, so um, so uh, any eight of them would cost about uh, eight. Any eight of the different characters of Lego Men for eighteen quid, which is great. So I'm like, you know what, may as well. Um, if I bought it individually, it would be worth three pound each. So, but. If you're wondering where I got this, this is the page as well. Uh, it's called Custom 3D Frame, is what it's called. So that's where I got it from. So I, uh, if you they've got their Facebook page, you can check out their Facebook page because I'm gonna be buying more Lego Men's actually for because I like to collect in Marvel stuff. So, so that's that's that. Um, because I like collecting Marvel stuff definitely. And then next one, I I went to uh, Jamie and uh, Amy's uh, their stall. So I can't remember the name of the stall, but. I bought uh, the, these two boxes of Digimon, so <laughs> they're these two Digimon boxes, so they're worth like about nine quid each. So I I never I don't think I've got these ones before. I know I got this. There's like three different volumes. This is the first volume, so at least I had to pick this up anyway. So because and then the next day after it got sold out really quick, which is crazy. You know how you get some Digimon fans, and even I am. But um, you know what? I'm gonna be open this. I want to see what I get. Because I have no idea what I'm going to get, so... Let's see what we get here, alright, anyways. Oh my goodness! Oh, nice, I got Paramount, nice! That's the one I wanted, for, you know, because I'm going to be cosplaying TK at some point soon, but uh, that, I've got a plushie of Paramount and now I've got that. Yes! So happy, man. That's Thanks, Jamie and Amy, for that. So that's, that's going to go in my collection. Thank you. And then now, box two. I have no idea what I'm going to have. I have no idea what I'm going to get as well. I don't want to damage the boxes. I'm thinking of keeping up some boxes nowadays. Let's see, what's the next one? Let's see. Alright, oh, okay. We've got Palmon as well, so it's all the different pieces. That one there, that's all uh, joined together as one. I've got Palmon, so oh well. That's pretty cool. I've got two different ones now. So I mean, I'm quite happy with them. So, I thank Jamie and Amy for it if you're watching, so thanks so much though, I really appreciate it. I got two two good ones now, quite happy with it. Uh, the next one I'm going to be showing you, I went to the anime and uh, DVD section area, uh, a DVD and Blu-ray section area of the, for animes mostly. Uh, I got, one of my favourite ones would be, the one the recent one I, I just, oh I finished watching Sephiroth for the end, first one, first season and the second season, which is great. That was my first time watching it. I actually really liked it because it's similar to Attack on Titan, and uh, I like the characters because I like the charisma, the personality and stuff, and the voice actors as well, pretty much. <laughs> um, so I went down uh, to the one of the anime uh, areas for the Blu-ray and DVD section, and then I finally managed to pick up uh, Sephiroth the end uh, part one. I think I uh, part one first season. Uh, season 1 part 1, so it's the first one, so um, I got this on DVD because because uh, I've, I've, sometimes when I'm in my living room uh, it's got a DVD but it doesn't have a Blu-ray so I may as well just watch uh, that that anime up either up in my room or even my living room and stuff so um, so I'll be watching that you know whenever uh, I'll show you what it looks like, I'll show you what it comes with it behind so Basically, it comes with the, the obviously the two uh, the two disc. I think yes, it comes with two disc. Uh, it comes with four uh, postcards, uh, posters, and we've got I uh, we've got I uh, four postcards, and then you got one full poster. Uh, you get you know one of those uh, you get one of those book, uh, small guide books and stuff like that tells you about the characters and you know who they are and stuff and you know just basically like a, a wee design how they made stuff, how they made this anime. Uh, I think that's pretty much it. They, they have, I'm sure it looks like anyway, so that's what inside it generally what it comes with. So uh, if you, hopefully you can see this. Um, but I got this for 30 quid. Uh, this is on DVD, so I got it for 30 quid, but Blu-ray was like 36. So I was, it's, just, it's, 
it doesn't make any difference. Um, it's still the same, uh, the same uh, stuff they come with. It's just that either you can get a Blu-ray or DVD, but I decided to go with DVD instead. So, um, so I'm gonna be watching it again. I'm gonna try to watch it again because I actually love this anime now. So, because <laughs> I actually quite. Because I wasn't so sure uh, of this anime from the start, but when I saw a lot of people cosplaying and talking about it, I'm like, may as well give it a go, uh, I'll try to watch it, and then when I watched it, I was like, oh, good, that looks really good, so I kept going, going, watching it, so, so yeah, I actually like this anime, so I'm going to try to rewatch this again, so hopefully soon, so that's that, uh, also, I went to one of the the car, uh, train car game shop, uh, the dealer's area. So I bought two Yu-Gi-Oh tins, which is uh, two Mega tins, uh, which is uh, Seto Kaiba and Yugi Moto tin. So I bought these two, one uh, one of each. Um, so because uh, when I saw them, they cost about fifteen quid, like each. And I'm like, what? Fifteen? Normally it's about like uh, almost twenty pound, but th these two are like fifteen pound each. I was like, I had to pick this up. So I'd, I'll be I'll definitely be opening these. Uh, I'm gonna to have to make a, a separate videos with them because I don't know what cards I'll end up getting and stuff. So which is great. Um, I'm actually looking forward to it though, to, to be honest. So, um, but yeah, I'll ho I'm definitely making separate videos. So just keep an eye on it. See, I don't know what packs. I don't know what cards I'll get from the packs. I know the promos. I will tell you. So, so that's easy. So I'll be op opening another videos, uh, other videos for for these ones at uh, another time. And my last one would be I went down to uh, Geek Retreat, which I thank you, thank you Geek Retreat for hold, holding some of the the Pokemon stuff. Um, I thought they would get sold out, but um, there were still loads actually because even though it's quite expensive, the the special set, the the one I bought is the Pokemon Elite Trainer Box uh, Generations. I'm actually quite I'm happy of it. The reason I didn't want to buy it right away a couple of weeks ago and stuff because well it released a couple of weeks ago, but I didn't want to buy it right away because I'm saving my money uh, for MCM. I know they will sell this in MCM, so which is which is, it got me save money and time and all that stuff. So I'm quite happy with it. Um, it is a really big box. It cost me about four forty five pound. I or I forty five pound for it. I know it's ridiculous. Uh, normally. Normally it would be thirty five pound or thirty quid, uh, aye, thirty quid or thirty five pound for elite trainer box. But see, this one this is forty five because it's a twenty, uh, it's a twentieth anniversary. Uh, I would say it's like a really special edition box. Um, it comes with basically what it comes with. Right, it's got eight packs of generations, uh, one promo of uh, shaman. Um, you got uh, in all different types of energies as well, along with it, five each of them. Uh, you got uh, the dice as well, you got like uh, coins for uh, poison and burn and then you got a guidebook which is uh, great because I need a guidebook to see what cards I'm after nowadays and so I can remember and you get sleeves along with it which I think yeah you get sleeves along with it so I'm quite happy with this box anyway so I'll be opening this in a, in a separate video as well so in another time because um, I don't want to open this right away because I don't know what cards I'll get so I'm just gonna set it aside and see. I'll take my time and see what <laughs> see see if I can try and make another video for it. So, so that's that. So that's all the the stuff I got for today. So, I know it's not as many. I know it's kind of a little bit disappointing because obviously I wanted to buy more uh, figurines and all that stuff, but some are a bit too expensive. I had to buy some uh, like I had to buy some like food and supplies. Obviously, um, I need to, because obviously every time you go to conventions, you need to have. You need to have food and drink along the way because if you don't, you may end up collapse or you end up dying. Actually, pretty much. Um, so that's that's the reason why I'm not able to just try and spend as many as much, which just sucks. I will be spending. I will do my best try and spend more. It's kind of hard trying to save money nowadays and all that stuff because since I'm working, um, but some of the stuff they sell is a bit expensive or itchy price. But I, the ones, some of the stuff I got are okay. I'm quite happy with. Um, but no, it was it's a shame that. Uh, I wish I could do a little bit better because uh, spending more stuff, but it's because it's, it's so busy and it's so hectic as well uh, for Saturday. But Sunday was quite quiet, but it's a shame that I wish I spent more. And I wish like I wish I would like save up money more. So, but yeah, I will see. We'll see how it turns out for next year once I go back again and all that stuff. So, um, so yeah, thanks guys for watching this video. So, 
Um, I don't know what I don't know what guys you've got. Whoever went to MCM Comic Con or bought stuff from there, uh, I don't know what a guy. What I don't know what you guys got uh, got as well. So, because I've seen some of the some of my friends what they've got as well, which are lucky. You know, jammy gets. <laughs> I would say. But yeah, thanks for watching though. I will upload other videos uh, eventually soon as well. So just keep an eye on it and then just keep uh, following my channel, support my channel as well. So so please subscribe, like and comment and see what you think about all the stuff I got as well. So um, I will upload the other videos soon. So just keep watching my videos, right? I appreciate it. So I'll, I'll need to go now because like, I need to do some other things at the moment. I need to sort out my photos and videos. So, so yeah, thanks for watching and I'll see you guys soon. Peace.